the whole rap program. Well, yes. So I have, I have ended my program. <laughs> I told you that uh, we are out of mission. The next program, that one is it's over to you. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> um. <clears throat> I think the next thing that we're going to do is uh, uh, we'd like to see where the land is. Yeah. And then uh, another that one, my brother uh, is going to be in the, in the, in the, uh, uh, my brother's hands for us to go see the land. And then uh, we also like to see the beach. We also like to see the beach. I, know I took some uh, uh, videos. I put it there. So we also like to see the beach, and then from the beach, um, we will come to say Nana to ask permission and leave, or we should ask. No, I think we should go and come and ask permission to leave. Or yes, I must know whether you come back from the land or whatever. Yes, to give you the feedback yes. of the land. Okay. On our way coming, um, uh, the lawyer called me. Yeah, he said we here by eleven. Yeah, he called me, he said he's on his way coming. So maybe by the time we go there, he will be around so that we also see the lawyer and then uh, Yes, uh, we have to get all the legal documents. To, yes. Uh, so we can exactly. share with everyone so exactly. they can process it. Exactly. And exactly. So we can get started. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so on this note, Nana, we would like to, uh, if someone has a question, yes. please. It's very, very possible that one or two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight uh, have a question um, to ask. Please, there's an opportunity. We are so pleased to have Nana uh, because he's a very busy person. So if there is any question, please, let's ask now. Yes, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, I was here earlier. I went up to see the land and I got here. Okay. And my question was walking up to the land. Uh, we talked to who about the infrastructure, the street uh, that needs to be put in place. Is it a community project? Uh, we know our land, once we get it, we'll put our roads in. But as far as coming from the main highway up, how do we go about that? Okay, I would like my brother to uh, say something first and then uh, he would like to know um, about the road network on the land. How do we go about it? If I may carry it. Uh, am I right? Yes. Thank you. Here is uh, Mispa Asam. So, as for road network, network, the Mispa Asam, we shall consult the MC to know how far how best we can organize ourselves. Yeah, and then the road, road, road network, network on the land apart. Yes, yes apart, uh, from the main road up to the area that we're actually acquiring. So that would be different. The main the main road to that side community. Yes. yes. Towards the, where the land is. Yes. Yes, Ghana, most of our institutions are not up and doing. You go and tell this assembly, come and control the wood, it will never be done. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Because uh, I have a lot of rules in my community. They will not do it. Yeah. Yes, so you yourself won't get a surveyor who will be able to get you appropriate uh, landmark of where you are going to stay. Okay. Yes. Then you do the construction yourself. Oh, okay. That's what I wanted to make sure. Yes, so then you do the construction yourself. Nobody will uh, stop you from doing that. Okay. But we get permission from you, then we get to Oh, you can do that. You got the land there. You need access to the land. Yes. So why should somebody stop you? Okay. <laughs> you understand? But once we get it put up, you know how uh, we were looking at other parts. This is a secondary question. Uh, once you get the land going through, and then I saw all these big trucks and stuff. Can you make it a private road? Can you charge? I mean, because I don't want to tear the, the street. I saw it as we came up. A part of the street was torn up. And I'm like, okay, that needs to be fixed. That's a community project. But if we get our land up and running, and then I see some heavy trucks tearing up my street, the street that we do as a community, 
yeah. that would be inappropriate. So no, you see, uh, the area probably been uh, laid out, okay. right? As you are going to stay there, you can have your road to the place. Okay. It may be passing on somebody's land. Mm. You understand? Okay. But when it comes to the, the time that the person wants to develop, you can still make a way out from his land and get to your land. Okay. You see, the permanent road that you want to, if you want to do a permanent road, yeah. you have your architect, they will do that one for you. My surveyor can make it such a way that you have the road permanently from the main road to your land. Yeah. That will be a permanent one. Okay. Very well. But if you are, if not, and you won't decide to do anything, you may do it, but may, may pass through somebody's plot of land. The person has not developed, and it can be passing on. By the time that the person is coming to develop, then you should know that you need to, uh, yes, pass your road out from the land. So, as you as you are saying, definitely when you can you want to do that, you consult my surveyor. You will know where plots are allocated. Okay. Then you can do permanent ones to your land. On your land, it's about 15, 15 acres. That's why you get an architect to make a drawing where you'll be putting your infrastructures, where the roads will be there, where you have a community uh, center for the people who live in there, and whatever you want to put. In that one architect can draw, make it on the 15 acre land, designed one for you. And then, so that when you want to do anything, you look at that design and then do it. That one, you yourself will get an architect who is very good to do that for you. But for the, from, the, from the place to the main road, that one you can consult my surveyor. He will know where he has allocated the land to other people so that you can have a permanent road. Okay. Yes. Yeah. In addition to what Nana is saying, there are well-designed roads on the land. Well earmarked road on the land. The government is supposed to do it. But because currently the government is not ready to do it. So as a result of that, why don't you bring a machine to clear the road for you just to drive in and yes. out? Two. Currently, you might be driving, when you are going to your land, you might be walking or driving on someone's land. But as they design, the um, survey finish designing on that land, the right road will be yeah. there for you. So you will not be, someone will not drive on your land anymore, you will not drive on someone's land anymore, but you see the layout is there already. But it's up to... Uh, the government to do it, but the government is not ready to do it. So you just volunteer, uh, do yours. So therefore, if you continue from here, you do from here to this place. I do mine from here to the end. This person do his from here to the end. By the time we realize, we we'll finish with the road. So everybody can drive in on the right road. Yes, that is what Nana remembers. Thank you. Thank you, Nana. Yes, please. Oh, and, no.